certified most accurate four zone weather with meteorologist Jeanette Kaye. All right, let's talk weather. We're going to see some changes uh, later this week. In fact, big warm up uh, for tomorrow and Friday. Before the warm up, we're going to see some rain in the area, scattered showers, maybe even some thunderstorms. Today, cooler than normal with plenty of clouds, small rain chance. That chance for rain increases, though, as the next weather maker moves across the area. That will be late today into the day tomorrow. High pressure moves in as we go into the weekend, so beautiful for Friday and Saturday. Sunday, not bad. The wind increases, the cloud increases, the cloud cover, I should say, increases on Sunday. Out ahead of another storm system, that will likely bring us the chance for more showers and storms on Monday. Temperatures right now coolish, mostly 50s, mid to upper 50s, but it is chillier in the hill country. It's not as cold as it was yesterday morning in many spots. Track the humidity level. So at the surface, the air is still pretty dry, but aloft, there is still a lot of moisture. And once the upper low that's currently parked to the west of our region moves eastward, we're going to see an increase in low level moisture. So by tomorrow morning, the humidity will be higher. Tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening, dew point still pretty high in the 60s, especially from San Antonio to the eastern zone. With that moisture aloft, we're seeing plenty of clouds across the area. There goes the upper level disturbance around low pressure, winds flow counterclockwise, so that's why we're getting that increase in uh, Pacific moisture. Across the country, in the uh, Intermountain West, specifically around Montana near Billings, there's a little bit of snowfall that's going to continue to move off towards the east. Fresh snow again this morning, downwind of the Great Lakes. Across the deep south, it's chilly, uh, but not as cold as yesterday morning and clear skies across the deep south. Let's track the upper low. So it's going to continue to move off towards the east. Uh, it's going to bring scattered showers, a couple of thunderstorms to the state. Friday into Saturday, that's over the deep south. In wake of that, an upper level ridge builds. That's why it's going to be very nice Friday and Saturday. Uh, we are going to see the showers and storms increase in coverage and maybe in intensity late tonight uh, after midnight, continuing into Thursday. Uh, tomorrow night, the showers and storms move to the east setting us up for a clear and dry Friday. A cold front comes in on Monday, late Sunday into Monday. Scattered showers and more thunderstorms possible Monday. Severe storm outlook. This is for later on today, tonight. Marginal risk to the south and east. Tomorrow, that risk is closer to San Antonio. We'll have to watch storms in this area. If they develop, could produce high winds and hail. Cloudy and coolish this morning. 10% rain chance, maybe a few sprinkles. This afternoon, a shower or two. Otherwise, keeping it cloudy because of the cloud cover forecast high, cooler than normal. 64. That's it for San Antonio. The western zone should see low 70s with more sun. 40% rain chance tonight into tomorrow. Tomorrow's high 76. Friday, mostly sunny 80. Saturday, partly sunny 76. Sunday, becoming mostly cloudy and windy 76. Monday, a 40% rain chance. Here's the extended forecast for the other three zones. In the western zone, a high on Friday, close to 90, maybe 91. You can get this online at news4sa.com. Click on weather. That's a look at your four zone weather. We'll be right back.